so first things first oh well, i just woke up so i'm kind of like a mess but like also have like a dress on so it could look kind of weird but um anyway i want to thank you guys so much for all of your comments on my last video um about cutie it has made me feel so much better all of your comments made me cry but like in a good way because they made me like so happy because you guys were just being like so sweet and just so like reassuring of everything so i'm trying to like move forward with everything obviously i'm never gonna forget about cutie and i'm just trying not to like focus on the sad things and just trying to like keep living a happy positive life um knowing that she's better but um i wanted to start vlogging again and because i feel like vlogging makes me so happy so i wanted to vlog and i just got this dress back from the dry cleaners so i thought i'd show you guys um so basically my mom and i went to my favorite antique shop um which is called the carousel antique shop it is in stanfordville new york i recommend everyone goes there if you live um close enough to go they have the best vintage things ever um i took did i take tori i can't remember I don't think Tori and I went because, oh yeah, Cutie was sick when Tori came. We were supposed to go, but we ended up not going. But I did take Gabby and Allie, and they were obsessed with it. So I usually take people whenever they come because it's just amazing. But anyway, I found this little 1950s, it's actually a 1950s bridesmaid dress. And I never have luck with vintage dresses. They never fit me. And, like, you guys, look how perfect this fits like it literally fits like a glove and i don't how do i show you guys the back of this dress maybe if i go like this i don't know if you guys can see how gorgeous wait how do i do this there we go like look how gorgeous the back of the dress is like it's just like so stunning and like you guys can like see it literally fits me like a glove like it is perfect like i don't even understand it like i never have luck with dresses like especially vintage dresses like they always just fit so awkwardly like even like this little booby part <laughs> fits me so well and i finally just tried it on for the first time like really because when i tried it on at the store i had like jeans on and like uggs and i had a t-shirt so i couldn't really see what it looked like but i was like let me just buy it it was only $30. It was so cheap. They had actually a matching hat with it, but they couldn't find it, so they marked down the price to $30. It was originally $35. Um, it's just so pretty. I don't know if you guys can see like all the details on it. And I thought it would be really cute for Easter, like if I do like a little like vintage Easter or something. So I'm just like obsessed with it and I can't stop staring at it because I'm like I'm like so shocked like how well it fits me like it's crazy i kind of want to get like oh my hair is such a mess i like slept in braids last night so that's why it's like all awkward but anyway i kind of want to get like a little like vintage hat to put on with it and like wear like little gloves just for like a picture i don't think i could wear that all day but i just think it'd be like such a cute like picture for easter i don't know easter is my favorite holiday if you guys didn't know um i just feel like it's so like Everything is so like pastel -y and so pretty and it just, it feels like vintage -y, like to me. I don't know, it just feels so old fashioned and like comforting. So I think also too, if you guys have never seen the, the movie Easter Parade with Judy Garland, you guys have to watch it. It's so good. I was just watching it yesterday. So I got like really excited for Easter. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm gonna get out of this dress. I have to go to Target. Um, I don't know when I'm going to be uploading this vlog, so I probably can't tell you guys what's going on. Okay guys, so right now I'm on my way to Target, and um, in my last clip I was starting to explain that like I wasn't going to tell you guys why I had to go to Target, like what I had to get, but um, I'm just going to explain to you guys and then just upload this vlog like the day that it's happening, that way I don't have to worry about people finding out. But. I don't even know if my family watches my vlogs and my dad was like, do not vlog this. And I was like, okay. So pretty much, um, we're having a surprise party for my grandma. Not the one that you guys always see, but like a different one. Um, she's my dad's mom. And pretty much we were supposed to, like the entire family was supposed to go. It ended up falling through. Um, 
and we weren't able to go. It was supposed to match up with our trip to Disney, so like we were already gonna be in Florida, so we were gonna go, but they ended up having to do it a different day. So my dad came over last week and was like, hey, like how about you and I just go and like surprise everyone, and it'll be another surprise onto the surprise party, and I'm like, I don't know, but I said yes and my sister and her husband are going like they don't know that we're going so it's like a huge surprise um so yeah that's why i couldn't tell you guys just in case my sister like or cousins like randomly watched my vlogs which i don't know if they do but you never know so i have to go to target and get some stuff for like a carry-on and all that good stuff so i will see you guys when i get into target okay so i just got to target i don't know if you guys can hear frank Sinatra in the back. I love listening to Frank Sinatra in the car. So relaxing. Um, I was trying to think. I felt like I was like t forgetting to tell you guys something. Um, um, I'm like kind of nervous but kind of excited. I um, ended my contract with Style Hall. So I'm kind of like, I'm just like on my own now with YouTube. Um, I'm still like making videos for Awesomeness TV and DreamWorks. But like I don't have a network I'm signed with. So it's like so weird. Okay. Get in my purse and let's go into Target. Okay guys, so I'm back and I'm just gonna do a quick little haul. I'm probably gonna end up putting some of this stuff into my main channel haul, which I'm probably gonna do in like a couple weeks. But anyway, first thing I got was this bag. I just like had a hiccup, so I just like stopped talking. Um, I got this little bag and it has like I'm not like taking all this stuff off yet. These are like little tassels just in case it's not the right size for a carry-on. I haven't flown in like, th honestly, it's been more than like three years, probably been like six years or so. Um, so I can't even like remember like what everything needs to be, but I think this should be an okay size for a carry-on. Um, <clears throat> this was $44.99 and above it, like as I was like, getting ready to pay i saw that they had like a thing it's like if you text this number you get like a five dollar off coupon so i got five dollars off of this which was great this is all from target by the way next thing i got this is like so me it's so adorable i needed like a clear case to put all of my stuff in for the flight so this came with three different um little pouches and they're just so cute and like summery looking this was only $14.99. It was like so inexpensive and I just thought it was perfect for everything I need. Um, I got like a bunch of these like little bottles to put um, all of my stuff in. And then I also got some of these like the Yes to Cucumber face wipes. I know a lot of people use these and love them. But I remember I tried them out one time and I think that they like really irritated my skin but um, this was the only, only travel size they had, so I was just like, whatever, I'll just grab it. And I also had to get some coconut oil. I got the Crisco brand one. I don't know how good it's going to be. Um, it was only like $6. Like, it was like on sale. And then this is like 22 ounces, so, or 27 actually. So it's like a really big container. Um, I just thought it would be okay though for like my hair and stuff like that. Okay, next is forever 21 and it's funny because um Alyssa, my friend um i don't know if you guys know she's a youtube channel she actually just uploaded a haul this morning and she showed this dress from forever 21 and i was like oh my gosh that's such a cute dress like it would be perfect for um for my trip because like i, need, I wanted to get like some type of like just like summery looking dress and I didn't think that they would have it at Forever 21, so I didn't even go there like thinking like they're gonna have it. But I saw it, so I ended up getting it. And it looks so adorable on. It's like super like 70s-ish looking. Um, but basically, it's just like this little um, white dress. And it doesn't do it justice. Like it looks so much better on. And then the bottom has like little um, details on it. It just looks so cute and like... I don't know. I just love it. I think it's going to be perfect for the trip. Then I got, and that dress was $24. Then I got this tank top. And it's just like a plain tank. It's not super cropped. Like, it comes to like here. So it's not like too cropped. Um, this was, let me see. Um, this was $6.90. 
I decided to go with for pink. They had like other colors, but I don't know. I just like the pink. And then I've been wanting a denim um, little like bandana for years now. I just haven't been able to find one. And randomly, Forever 21 had it. So this was only $3.90. So I had to get that. Last but not least, I went to Michael's and I just got some of this flower garland. I'm actually, I'll bring you guys with me. Um, I'm gonna put this on my headboard thing that I made when I moved in. Cause I think it's just gonna like look pretty and just like add a little extra touch to it. So I'm gonna put that on now. Okay, it looks so cute. And I, I had a feeling it wasn't gonna like fit across this whole thing. Cause this is really big. But I really just didn't feel like spending a bunch of money. And I think it actually looks kind of cute just in the center. Um, maybe eventually I'll get um, more to fit, but I'm actually not minding it, especially if it's just like for a video. Um, I'm probably only gonna be like in that section anyway. So I love it. I think it looks so adorable. Um, but yeah, that was all that I got from um, Target and the mall and Michaels and everything like that. So right now I'm making some lunch. I have this bread. If you guys see this bread at your grocery store, you should definitely buy it. Um, when I was staying with my parents for a little bit, um, and they got this bread, and I was like, what is this? It's amazing. It's so good. It's like a really, like, hearty bread, and it's, like, actually, like, kind of, like, thick, I feel like. But anyway, so then I put on the roasted pine nut hummus, and I'm going to put a cucumber on it. I already had, like, one... Um, of these sandwiches ready. I'm just gonna have another though. So, um, it's a little bit later since I vlogged. Um, I have like a headache right now. My doctor, I went to the doctor because I've just been feeling like so sick lately and he gave me like a medication to start going on and like not looking forward to it because I don't know if you guys know this, but I hate taking medicine. I even hate taking like Advil if I have a headache and I've always had issues with like my stomach hurting and, um, migraines and stuff like that and the migraines went pretty much went away like once i stopped drinking coffee and of course like right now i'm drinking coffee because like i feel like whenever i have like a really stressful week sometimes i'll just like have a cup of coffee because <laughs> it like relaxes me but um yeah so like he put me on a medication and i'm kind of nervous because i have to start it soon and like i'm gonna be going on vacation so i don't know if it's gonna like affect me in a weird way because like sometimes like medication like makes me like get sick and like throw up and stuff but where was, I don't know why I'm telling you guys this. I feel like there was something I was saying. I don't remember. Oh, I don't, I don't even know. But anyway, um, I'm just sitting with Willby right now. My mom just stopped by and she brought me, um, my mom is like a dry cleaning, like freak. Like she has to dry clean everything. So, um, I got this really cute tablecloth. When I want antique shopping, I feel like I'm showing you guys everything that's going to be on my main channel haul. Like, I have a ton more, but I'm giving you guys, like, so, um, such, like, a little sneak peek of everything. But this is so cute, and I'm really excited. I'm going to use it tomorrow for my video, which is going to be an Easter video. So, I think it's going to look really cute with that. And then she also dry cleaned this little vintage tablecloth, but this one's not new. I think... In a couple weeks, it's going to be like the two-year mark of when we got Wilbur. Um, so I'm excited for that because I can't believe I haven't even had him for like two full years yet. It's like so weird. Um, I feel like he's like been with me for like five years already, but it hasn't been that like at all. So I'm excited to have our little anniversary. What do you think? Do you like living with me? All right, so I'm in bed right now. And um, I just bought something else. I don't know if I explained this before, but I feel like I've been spending so much money the past week just like buying stuff. But um, I'm happy because I like, I never really do that. Like I always like feel guilty buying stuff. Like I have like no guilt. I'm just like, I'm just buying it. It's something that I've been wanting to get. So I'm just gonna do it. But anyway, what I just bought was like under $6. <gasps> You're so cute. He always has his mouth open. <gasps> Willby, look at those teeth. Anyway, 
Um, I'm just going to end the vlog off here. So thank you guys for watching today's vlog. And hopefully I'll have some fun vlog footage from Florida. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be too shy to like vlog in front of my family. We'll have to see um, how I feel around them. Because I haven't seen them all in like... I don't, I don't even know. It's been so long since I've seen that side of the family. So we'll have to see how I feel. But um, anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Goodbye, baby. <laughs>